fun thank you so much to all of you for tuning in today welcome to my channel and i want to welcome my very very special guest angela barthel from shantikai Ta -da! <laughs> so happy to be here with you guys i see florida's in the house tampa south florida that's so exciting seattle Ooh. i'm so excited to be here with you tonight so we can get glammed up together yes we have canada here too alice and chase hello mo makeup mo beauty our friend jaddy hey. from jaddy's beauty she's gonna be our moderator tonight oh my 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 <laughs> selenita oh my goodness thank you oh, so yes. much congrats, for being here Allison, for 10k congrats ladies Yay. Oh my goodness, so happy to be here. So I want to introduce Angela Barthel. She is a manager and educator for Shanta Kai. And she has been in this industry and a makeup artist for over 20 years. She has a lot of experience that she can share with us. She has worked with multiple large companies too and she has also been on the film industry right angela yeah yeah i did i did tv and film when i lived in la um but i enjoy the beautification of the everyday woman more than i enjoyed working on a film set so that's really truly where my heart is um and i just enjoy women lighting up when you share with them tips and tricks and things that you have going on so uh, it's 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 good to be on this side um, with everyone that loves makeup and, and to enjoy um, seeing people light up when they get their makeup done and when they gl get glam like we're gonna do tonight. Yes, we have something very special, right, Angela? Absolutely. Yes. So, well, we have a little. I'm gonna tease it, but we're gonna talk about it in the end. But we're doing a little giveaway with because we're gonna start off with we're gonna start off with skincare. But mm -hmm. we're doing a giveaway with this. I don't know if you guys have ever used this gold mask, but this gold mask is like butter. It does so much for the skin. You can do so much with it. Um, so I think this mask, this, we'll talk about what's in here because we're getting ready to use some of these products. And then, of course, you can't have Shantikai without rose water. So we're going to do a little mini rose water. It looks like this. You'll get mm -hmm. one of these. Sorry, this is always backwards for me, so I got to figure out. Uh, we're here and it's all together. <laughs> there we go. So we'll be giving away one of these. So hang tight. You'll have an opportunity. And also inside of it, you guys know our beautiful fall lip colors. So whoever wins gets to pick whichever lip color they want. And we will send it to you guys. Jacqueline, I'm, I'm going to let Jacqueline be in charge of how, who, how she raffles that off. Okay? Okay, okay, we're gonna talk more about all of those beautiful goodies right there a little bit later. And we're so excited because we're gonna showcase what, Angela? Ooh. But first, we need no. to talk about Jacqueline. How, what is, let's talk about your love for Lux makeup. Because oh. I know that when I first connected with you a few months back, you were like, oh, I need the Soleil. I love, I love the post uh, the, I can never say that. Uh, that uh, Positano. The, yeah, Positano. There we go. Positano. Positano. <laughs> so I just want to know your background and why you have such a great love for Lux Manga. Well, I think it all started with my mother. And in fact, more than makeup, she taught me since very young age to actually take care of my skin. And that was her big thing, skincare at all times. Like, you know, make sure you use a really good moisturizer, really good serum, 
In fact, when I turned 15 years old and I was allowed to <laughs> wear some type of makeup, the first counter that we went, it was just specifically for a skincare. And then I always saw my mom just um, wearing luxury makeup. That's that's what she enjoyed and that's what she, if she had to pamper uh, for herself on something, because I mean, I mean, I can talk about my mom for forever, but um, at a certain point in time, my, my dad passed away and we were six kids and she raised us all in Peru and I mean such an amazing woman but when she pampered herself it was about makeup and skincare so that's kind of like how everything has started it and then as I grew up obviously just everything coming so natural but um, yeah that, that's how everything has started and what about you Angela how did you start here like becoming a makeup artist well, I mean, I think, I can't believe I've been doing this for over 20 plus years. We won't talk about my age, but I just turned 40, so I've been doing this for a little bit. But I was always like you, my mother, I always remember when I was, even when I was little, she would like, in Saturday mornings, we'd be listening to music and she would be, she would have her Noxima mask on her face while she's like doing the beds. And she was always just there, her poise and her glamour. We were also immigrants too. So my mom took a lot of care of how she looked, how she dressed. She was always like the elegance for me. So I always emulated her and how she just took care of herself from fragrance to makeup. It was always just the best. So I was, I always just at an early age loved to do makeup and then it just elevated from there. So I started doing makeup at Lancome. My first counter, I was 18 years old. I started doing Lancome makeup. And then I just, that through college, I went to move to California. I worked for a couple of different uh, counters, Mac, Bobby Brown, I mean, the list goes on. I love all, but I ended up at Chantikai maybe about n almost nine years ago. And oh, I wow. love the naturalness of the brand. Like Chantikai to me was like, okay, I was pregnant with my daughter. I wanted all natural products. So I wanted to make sure that I were, uh, was putting on skincare that was good for me. So that's really where my love for Shantikai started was with the skincare. With so the skincare. after, mm -hmm. yeah, skincare was it. And after skincare, we evolved in the past nine years. We have grown leaps and bounds. And now we sh we we're showing a lot more um, color and expansion in our line, as you'll see here, because we're about to get real smoky and fun today, right? I know, it's gonna be a lot of fun. And actually, um, I kind of like to start knowing a little bit more about Shantikai because of Michelle Wan, who you know her. And I was right. like so intrigued. And then um, I was like, okay, let me start first with this <laughs> item right here and another item. And then I was just looking back to other collections and I came across the Positano collection. And many of you, all of you know, my husband is Italian and I have a special place in my heart for Italy. I mean, he's, you know, raised in there and he was raised in there and we have family in there, uncles, aunts, cousins, I mean, an entire family. Um, he's basically first generation here to immigrate. So, wow. Um, so when I, as soon as I saw that Positano collection, it, it just kind of like everything had to do with like, okay, I, I want to get my hands on it. I felt more in love about the brand. And then on, I think about a month ago, I did a Shantikai haul and I tried a few products. But now today I'm going to be trying with you, right, Angela, some skincare yeah. products because yeah. I haven't tried much. Just like a couple of things, the cleanse and balm, the new Rose de May balm, which is amazing. And then right. the foaming cleanser too. It's so good. For, I have dry skin and it actually surprised me that it didn't let me, um, you know, like dry or feeling too right. tight. No, yeah. it doesn't strip the skin, which is great. It, it, it has a hyaluronic acid in it, which keeps your skin nice and, 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 and feeling soft. So that's the great thing about it. But the great thing is, is the Positano collection couldn't be even the most best thing to start off with, because in a second, 
we're going to talk about the unveiling of these two beautiful shadows right here, right? At the, the Soleil color from the Positano collection is actually the inspiration behind these shades. So that's, the, that's where the love of this particular texture of eyeshadow started. But before we start with that, let's start prepping the skin so we can get this beautiful, yes. these beautiful shades on, right? There you so, go, yes. So what would you suggest first? Let's see. So I let's, have... do, let's, let's, let's get our under eyes correct. So like when you do makeup, if you prepare the skin underneath, everything that you go on, you create this beautiful canvas on top then everything you put on just goes on smoother and everything else. So we're gonna do eyes. So you got one of these eye masks, right? These beautiful eye yep. masks, gold yeah. eye masks. Right? And thank you so much, Angela and Shantikai, because they have been sending me so many beautiful goodies right here. Mm -hmm. Thank you so, so these, much. There you go. Here are, we go. They're amazing. So we're gonna open it up. And the great thing about this is when you open this, you wanna just open it up a little bit from the corner because a little secret trick, you can use this more than one time, right? So you're oh. gonna slide the little, you're gonna slide this out mm -hmm. and you're gonna get this little little gel. So you can do this one of two ways. I personally like to put the thicker part under my eyes because I have puffy eyes, I'm East African, and I drink a lot of, I don't drink enough water, I have a lot of salt. Or if you want, you have some fine lines underneath the eyes, you can flip it and make the fatter side on the outside. You know, if you wanna, if you wanna take care of the lines. Because basically what this is, you can wear it this way. Mm -hmm. You guys see that on here? You can wear it this way with the fatter side on like the outside. This. Or you can wear it like Jacqueline has it on. Because I like it the way she has it because it actually, it's like a little ironing board for underneath the eyes. It is an intensive, immediate treatment. I say keep it on for at least 20, 45 minutes, max. Mm -hmm. I met a lady one time that would sleep in these. So I guess she slept very um, beautifully to keep these on <laughs> wow. and have them on all night. But what they do is it's a, an intensive eye treatment for the eyes. Um, that's going to give you that smoothening effect. So it's going to get rid of fine lines and puffiness. And this is great to have like before you go to an event or do something like that. So let's put both of those on. Mm -hmm. And now this has some hyaluronic acid in it. Or... It does. It does. Okay. It has tomato stem. It has all these great products that's going to help you. It's a, it's, a, it's a type of hyaluronic acid that's in these pads that you can put on underneath your eyes. That is like, I don't know if anybody's ever used our gold gold roller ball. So it's an intensive treatment for the gold roller ball. So it has immediate effects that last 48 hours and then it has long-term effects. So I'm going to mm -hmm. do this one. So hold like on just this. a second. Ah, oh, there's some. I'm getting some buffery issues. Okay, the connection. I think you're good on my end. I see. Uh -huh. Okay. They said I was buffering. Okay. Okay, I see that. I see We're that. good? Okay. We will get better. Yeah, it will get better. By the way, welcome to everybody that arrived a little bit later. I see right there Rocio from Maxienta. I see Vicky J too. Lexi, Lexi John. Oh, thank you so much to all of you. Hi, yes, Sharon. Thank you guys for coming. Yeah. So uh, this is something that I okay, was so really intrigued about Shantekai is the botanicals. That is um, that are used on the skincare, right? So you were saying, like for right, example, the tomato absolutely. stems. So it's it's it, we do a lot of we were one of the first companies to do stem cell like like plant stem cells. As you know, plants have the closest in DNA structure as we do, so we react better, quicker, faster to plant-based products. So we use a lot of advanced technology with with plants and stem cells in our products so that you can use, um, so your skin actually reacts quicker. And then for those that have um, sensitive skin, you're not having such harsh chemical reactions to things and your body's not processing harsh chemicals. So with that being said, this has the gold technology in it. In Chinese medicine, they use the gold technology for healing. So this is a really great healing. And then with that, we just launched our Gold ampules. We won't oh, talk about this yes. one too much, but we gotta we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna just mention it because it just mm -hmm. got released. 
I just started my 28 days. Are you going to start using this and do your 28 tonight. days? Tonight. Yeah, tonight. Because this is going to be kind of like a recovering treatment, something that is mm -hmm. going to just reset my skin, correct? That's, that's what it is. It's like a good, intensive reboot for the skin. So it's going to help with fine lines, wrinkles, retexturization, the whole nine. So in 28 days, after using about three drops of this, you're going to notice like a whole rehaul on the skin. So I'd really like to see what you think about it after you use it for 28 days. 28 days and it's only at nighttime. I'm gonna use only at night. serums with that or just Absolutely. this? Absolutely, I would do this on a clean skin, do your three drops and then maybe you can do afterwards, maybe you can do your, um, your moisturizer if you need it, especially if you're dar uh, drier skin or you can mm -hmm. do any sort of, any sort of like serum that you wanna place on top of it. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, I'm going to start this. I'm super excited. I want to see the results. I promise you guys, I will bring you my results in 28 days. I will give you a feedback on this because this got me so excited. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 So, so now have... let's prep the skin. Mm -hmm. So we'll, we'll, the thing that we're going to use today to prep the skin is our Radiance Elixir. This is another newer product that we came out with that I particularly like. Because you can cocktail this. We all like cocktails. You can cocktail this however you want. You can mix it into your moisturizer. You can mix it into your foundation. You can put a, it's safe to be used around the eyes. It has a wake up peptide in it that helps your skin look awake, zoom ready and ready to go. So you could do it nighttime or daytime or both mm -hmm. if you want that look. Cause I get a little puffy myself. So I'm mm -hmm. gonna put a couple of drops on it before we get started. I like to put it on my lids because this is what I'm gonna use as kind of like a primer to get that canvas going before we put on these wonderful shadows. Well, and yeah, I was listening to you about these, using it as a primer, mm -hmm. I was just like, what, really? I never heard of something like this. Now, does this mm -hmm. elixir has any like vitamin C or? Um, no, it's got, any... a, it's got a particular wake up peptide in it. So you know when oh, you wake up peptide. in the morning mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and when you wake up in the morning and you, it takes about two hours before your face to look like you not just woken up. What this mm -hmm. does is it cuts that down in half. So in about 20 minutes, you're gonna look like you had a full night's rest. So it's gonna help with that, that circulation and that puffiness that you get from just waking up in the morning. So mm -hmm. if you use it at night, it's going to help you have less of that. And then if you use it in the morning, it just helps your skin just kind of get up and going. It's like the drink of coffee for your face. For the skin to day just or make night. it more like yes, mm. Exactly. Well, then then it has a little bit of radiance in it too so that you can mix it. I'm I'm of oilier skin. I know you said that you're dry. So some yeah. people like to cocktail it with different things. Some people want to put it with a moisturizer. I've been using this and my bio serum and that's what I've been using on my face. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think see, the radiance is very subtle, guys. So if you I mean, it doesn't have any shimmer, anything like that. It's just a subtle, very beautiful radiance. Okay, so should we put it all over the face then, or just? Yeah, you can put it in all over the face. Um, Robin asked if it's safe to use with Retin-A. It's absolutely safe to use with Retin-A. Great question. For sure. Great mm -hmm. question. The great yeah. thing about our pro the great thing about our products are they combine really well with other products. So some people um, like to mix and match with products they already have. Most of you guys have like a you know cure a well curated co like uh, cos cosmetic um, portfolio, I should say. So you have things that you like from different brands. So the great thing about our products is you can mix them with anything, and, and it's not really gonna change anything so that's mm -hmm. the great thing yes you can use it day and night mm -hmm. okay so mm -hmm. now i think we can talk about the two shadows we're gonna talk about tonight which i have them i have one of the colors striped on my hand because i'm gonna do a little oh my gosh you're out. fast <laughs> I know. well i did it earlier because i was playing around because i didn't know what look i wanted to do today so do you two, i mean i i I took pictures for Instagram because, you know, <laughs> you know, me and my pictures, and I was just admiring them. I haven't even swatched them. So I have zebra right here. Sorry, guys, I'm trying to be like, okay, where, where is everything? So this is zebra. <laughs> yeah. 
And here's the shape. And this is kind of oh, like beautiful. a rose gold, right? Yeah, it's a yeah, it's a it's a beautiful rosy. Yeah, it's like a rosy peachy tone. I'm gonna mm, I'm gonna it. swatch it on my hand so you guys can see it on my skin tone. Yeah, this is beautiful so too. By the way, for those who are new here, I'm I'm Peruvian and I have a light to medium skin tone. There you go. So. And this is it. It's on me here. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's on this. It's the bottom shade. It's a little brighter on me. I'm more of a medium to dark skin tone, but this is just a beautiful, beautiful shade. And I just wanted to tell you guys, I know the luminous eye people are obsessed with them, but what makes them so special is the fact that we support different organizations with each animal so as you see this animal this is actually the an grevy zebra there's only three thousand left in the wild currently so it's what they want them to do is they want to be able to help there's a organization it's called the grevy grevy zebra trust i wanted to make sure i said the trust right it's it's a new it's a new organization that we just started working with and what it does is it we, they work with the people and the habitat that they live in to make sure that they're not getting poached. So this is a great organization that this particular sale of this eyeshadow supports, which so anytime you're buying any of these beautiful shades, whether it's the pangolin or any of the ones that we have, it always goes to support a specific organization, right? Yeah, so and that's, that's what that. I love about Shantikai. You're always supporting an organization, always, always, always. I actually was reading about the organization that you, um, that Shantikai was supporting in um, the Amazon, in yes. between Colombia and Peru. I mean, like, and then causes. we ended up, I think, uh, if I'm not correct, I think Scott Patrick's on here, but I want to say that we ended up giving, we were able to raise $50,000 to give the show. I always, I don't want to say the name of the group of women wrong, but I think they're called Shoshomis mm -hmm. and they live in the Amazon and we were able to get them their protected land. So I just think that that was amazing. And that was from our spring hummingbird collection as, uh, you know, the, oh, actually I have a piece here I can show from, remember this, this beautiful powder that everybody was obsessed with. So Look this, the yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> there you go. And the eyeshadows and the lip colors. So that was part of that, um, that spring collection that went to those women. So yeah, it's always they wonderful. Were elder That's women part of too. Yes, the elders. Mm -hmm. So it, mm -hmm. the elders that, that they went to protect, it gave them their land because we know that the hummingbirds are part of that habitat in the Amazon that was getting burned down. So this went to protect their habitat. It went to protect the group of women that live there and they will always have this land and no one will be able to infringe upon them for any reason at all. So it helped them protect them. Mm -hmm. So, and I think somebody asked a question. Let me see if I can scroll back up to the question. Um, Lexi Jong said, which step do you use for the Radiance Elixir yeah. at night? So what do you mean, like, how, like at what point do you use the Radiance Elixir? Like, is that the question? Um, because I mix the Radiance Elixir with my, actually I have it here, with my bio serum together at night. I use a little more bio serum, a little less of this. In the daytime, mm -hmm. the opposite. I use a little bit more of this and a little less of that and then right now i'm mixing it with my cbd cream because i'm getting all this like acne from um wearing my mask all day and my skin's been very irritated yeah i can imagine and then they were already asking where to get these beauties right here so we will go over that in a minute right yes they're going to be live on the shantikai website tomorrow morning you guys so we'll talk about that. We'll have a code so that you can get like a gift with purchase, but we'll talk about the code as soon as we do a little demo. But first let's talk about cream, which is the color I'm going to be using today because I want to do a smoky eye. Because I think Sean, the great thing about Shantikai is that we have this like flawless, chic, uh, natural look, right? And so many people think that we don't know how to intensify. Well, today I'm going to show you how to step it up a couple notches. This yeah. beautiful shade is, I, I even got my nails done for you, Jacqueline, because I wanted to I take, know. take better to this, so fancy. Right? Yes. So I know, so I got pretty. real fancy for you 
guys. And that's the swatch, if you guys can see that. I look like I'm buffering on my end. I hope you guys, can you guys see me okay? Yeah, Hopefully can you, you see as well? Can. No, because I can't tell if I look very well, but. Some of them, they're saying yes, yay. Okay, yes. good. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, so, so this beautiful train is, is so Oof. beautiful, right? It's, it's oh, isn't that a sparkles. beautiful day? Look at how pretty that is. That is called the gray crowned crane. And in Rwanda, that is a symbol of wealth and longevity. So a lot of people obviously keep these as pets and clip their wings, and there's not that many mm. of them left. So we are working with the Rwanda Wildlife Conservation Association. And what they're doing is they're helping to get all of the birds that are in captivity, like hotels have them, people that are very wealthy have them, and they mm. try to rehabilitate them and put them back in the wild. So these are, it's such a beautiful color and it's such a beautiful bird. I'm so excited to put these on tonight. Excited. Well, hopefully okay. you can see these well. Hey, Flexi, these nails are, girl, they're, my first, na my first manicure since COVID, you guys. I was real excited, so I went all out. Okay. Yes. So Alrighty. are we ready to put a little eye? We are ready. I'm ready. I'm ready okay. to have some fun right here. Okay, so let me see. Okay. Where did I put it? Okay. <laughs> So I'm so going to jump I'm, first. Yeah. Totally. Okay, you go for it. Go. Go you, whichever color you want to put on. I'm going to prep my eye with a little real skin on top cuz I like to put I, I want I'm, I like to do layers on my eyes because I want I like a real intense smoky eye. So I start with this first layer. For me, it's real skin and I'm going to do it with my fingers. Okay. I'm gonna put a little you skin. You that and then you get ready over there. Do we have any, any, any questions? Okay, good. Thank you, Alina. I don't feel real. You guys are getting this Angela in her full. No concealer, no red lipstick. I don't let very many people see me like this. So we've got to be real <laughs> close for this to happen. Close and personal right there. Yes, we're okay. getting up close so, and personal. You know what? I want to try. What do you think if I try these? This yeah, do it. Do it. Come I think up? it'll be perfect. I think you'll enjoy it. Just kind of like a base? Yeah, you can use it as a base. You can actually mix it um, with the Radiance Elixir if you want to. Mm -hmm. If you want it to be thinned out. It's really, yeah. really pretty. And I think I got here the shade four. So after yeah. the live, I will make sure to just put everything that we put on our face on the description box so that you guys can see it. Okay, let me see. Just need to keep pressing. And I'm gonna take this brush here, and we're gonna. I'm gonna start with the crane all over my eyes. Let's see. I just purchased the other shades from Nordstrom. Heavy on the chai. Did you? Did you get that? Were you able to buy these shades, Heavy on the chai? I don't think that they're mm -hmm. out on them on their website yet. But we maybe. Maybe. You guys usually you guys usually find better than me. They find out better than me. Let's see. I just purchased the other shades from Nordstrom. I don't know. Okay, I mean, I always, I always keep up. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to keep up, like, whatever comes. So, no. I, you know what I'm going to do, you guys? I'm going to do, I'm going to do two different methods so you guys can see uh, two different ways. I don't know if you guys have ever had our Lester Glides, but on one eye, I'm going to use the Lester Glide all over my lid and amethyst. It's a beautiful purple color. Let me show you guys what this oh, looks like. Oh, kind of like a base. Yeah, as a base to give me more intensity, right? So you see that mm -hmm. liner color? I'm going to do that all over this eye and put the crane over it. But on this eye, I just want you guys to see how much color this has. And mm -hmm. I'm going to do this all over this eye. So actually, I have a shade and sweep brush, but I have such a mess going on over here with all my stuff. I can't find, oh, here it is. Here's my shade and sweep brush. So, okay, no, so you didn't get the new shade. Well, you can get the new shade at .com tomorrow morning, because you're gonna want them all. So this so is what that looks like. Can you guys see this? Wow, that looks gorgeous. Okay, and I'm gonna use that yeah, like from that. Looks I Duo in Kenya. Oh yeah, yeah. You need so that I'm as gonna, your base. Yeah, I'm gonna use a little bit of this as my base, just a dash. 
I'm gonna do this on this side so you guys can see. So you guys see this, this is how, I mean, and this is just this crane eyeshadow. Um, how many uses can you get from the eye mask? Honestly, I've taken mine on a weekend trip, so I'll take one, one of these packets on a weekend trip, so I'll, I'll do it Friday night, Saturday night, and Sunday night. So you can get about three. You don't want to open it too much. You want to kind of open it a little bit so that there's still enough uh, wonderful juices in there so you can just slide it right back in. And if you're good and kind of close it down like this, hold on. And you keep it closed like that, it stays pretty moist for a couple of days. Nice. Hope that answers that question. I'm putting okay, that so now, light shade okay, did, above oh, my pretty. crease, just just to let you know. I like it. Okay. Now, okay. you know what? I'm gonna. Now, would you suggest to use because I do have the luminescent eyeshadows. I have Lion, and my favorite one is Pangolin or Pangolin. Uh huh. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Pangolin. Huh. Yes. So, so what do you want to use? I'm gonna use C. I'm gonna use both of them. Okay. Okay. But I, but I want to ask you, do you suggest to just use your finger or brush? What's what's the best application? You like, can use whatever brush you want to. I suggest getting like a, a, a not such a fluffy brush or not a stiff brush to put that initial color in. Then put your initial. You can use whatever brush you have. I mean, I wish we had you had this shade and sweet brush because this is really good, but I'm pretty sure you have a brush that's similar to this that you can use to put it on with, right? Yes, yes. And now those brushes, because I know Shantikai has a few brushes, they are synthetic, mm -hmm. right? But made in Japan, yeah. correct? Yes, they are synthetic. Mm -hmm. We used to have natural hair brushes, but we decided to go and become vegan. So we now have... Um, all of our brushes are oh i need to look in here because I'm, I'm like i can't see what i'm doing i don't know where uh, now all of our brushes are vegan so nice. they're beautiful synthetic brushes so they don't hold bacteria mm -hmm. awesome so i just took just so you guys know what i did on this eye i took amethyst all over my lid and i'm now i'm gonna use i'm just gonna kind of smudge it out and I want to work with this. These luster glides are literally like silk, hence the name. But I want to work kind of quickly with it because they dry down very fast, which is a good thing because yeah. I can put the color over it. So okay. what color are you putting so down now? I'm actually, you know, I changed my mind. I'm going to go with crane. <laughs> Sorry, okay. guys. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm just playing around with makeup. We're going to have fun. Okay, I'm going to yes, go with crane. Yeah, and I'm just gonna put these down all over my mobile lead. Oh my gosh, that shade is gorgeous. I don't know if you can see it. It's so beautiful. You like what time are they going live tomorrow? I think they should be going live like at um eight eight um East Coast time, I'm pretty sure. I'm sure if you guys get up real early in the morning they should be live. Um, although I think the sale, someone asked about the sale, LJ asked about the sale. The sale, we had a Sylvie sale back in July oh. and the Sylvie sale was one of the first times we were, we ever offered 30% uh, off. So a lot of people stocked up on their Shantikai during the Sylvie sale. So that's probably the sale everyone's referencing. Awesome. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one. It was a great sale too. I I went home with that <laughs> for sure. I wanna let's see, what do I wanna do now? I kind of want to add more of the amethyst underneath. So I'm gonna use amethyst underneath my eye. And now I can still be I mean these eyeshadows are one and done. Pretty much. Uh -huh. I mean, there's not a lot that you have to do, and that's what I love about the luminescent and shadows. I mean, like I said, I have on my collection well now these two, but I have the lion and also the pangolin, and it's something that is just so easy, so easy to yeah. apply to use, and they look, just look, you know, more. And I'm just taking that amethyst liner, and I'm just smudging it underneath my eye because I want to 
I want to create a little drama here before I put the liner and the mascara on. So I'm just doing mm -hmm. that underneath. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Okay, now I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the same look on the other side. Can you guys have? Can you guys see that? Hopefully, you guys can see these colors. I'm gonna stick the amethyst under. I'm now, Crane has a little bit of like uh, pink sparkles too. Yeah, like when I I'm move, I take... see. Oh, That's really, really pretty. I like that. I'm gonna take the. I'm gonna take the zebra now and put it on the inner corner. I'm gonna just take it, and I'm using our eye definer brush, and I'm just gonna take it on the inner corner. Okay, I'm gonna take that. zebra. And I'm just gonna put it on the middle of my eyelid. Okay. How are you guys doing out there? Now you guys are what what are we what sale are we talking about now? The sale hasn't been announced yet. We got the info from the live. Oh, okay. Mm. You're talking oh, you guys must be talking about Cyber Week. That must be the sale you guys are also yeah. talking about. Cyber Week is coming up. Thanks, right after Thanksgiving. Yep. Okay, so I can use also the um, the pure rose water, right, to kind of like yeah. a spray the shadow, right? Absolutely, it gives it. You want you don't spray the shadow. Spray your brush and yeah. then dip it into the shadow. Yeah, yeah. Oh, then dip it in the shadow. I just yeah, so, so slightly spritz your brush and then you can, and it gives you more of a metallic look. Mm -hmm. Going here with this. I'm going to actually take the liner on top and kind of smudge. The cool thing too is you can use the back of the, so I want to create a nice little smoky eye here. Can you guys see this? What are you doing? I came, I came here by accident. Okay, well, join oh, welcome. in. And, well, <laughs> just welcome. Just join and have fun. We're just playing in makeup in these new two beautiful shadows so that everyone mm -hmm. can see that. You guys I'm see all this? Finger. Yeah, and I'm going to take a little bit of the zebra and I'm going to do it right in the middle and I'm going to use my uh, ring finger to kind of press it in to the ball of the eye, just uh, some dimension. See how that just kind of opens up my eye and makes it look more round. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to do this eye. So that's these colors. Aren't these amazing? They're beautiful. No. In a minute, we'll 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 put on some. Uh, maybe I'll start with. I'll do some some eyeliner right now. Let's see. No, I'm going to wait. I want to do a little bit more. I go back in, too, with my concealer. And I go in with number eight underneath my brow just to kind of highlight a little bit and clean that up. Oh, so let's see. I'm taking number eight right underneath my brow. Okay. Well, I think I want to take these patches off right now. Yeah, you can take yours off. I'm going to take mine and put my concealer on in just a second. You have the mascara. Are we going to do mascara? Are you ready for mascara or eyeliner yet? I'll wait on no, you. No, no. I actually like to go with my foundation, concealer, and then I go to Before finish you that. Before you do that? Last. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. I follow that lead. I'm going to actually do some eyeliner right now. That's what I'll do. I love our Listilo. Has anyone used our Listilo before? I love this. I mean, it, I like the felt tip on this guy. It's so great. Do you actually send it to me right here, Angela? So interesting. Yeah. And picked Goa, but it seems like it doesn't show on my... What CC... So, okay, I'm going to be honest with you. Um, Siddiqui, I, I think I can say your last name. I don't want to butcher your first name. We are actually working on expanding our bronzers. The Goa and the Serena are bronzers that I use for um, setting my makeup. 
we don't have one as deep. So when I want to go deeper and contour my face, I actually use our real skin and tint. And then I'll go in and use that as contour. So I hope that helps. And I hope that we have a bronzer really soon that's deeper. We're actually working. We just recently came out with Serena and Boa last summer. So they were trying to see if people liked that texture and they've been very, very popular. Mm -hmm. Jacqueline, you have them too. You like them, right? So I love them. I have um, by the them. next <laughs> summer, we'll have some deeper shades. I know, Siddiqui, it's, it's, it's hurting my heart. So hopefully we'll get some deeper shades. But right now, you can do the Radiance Gel Bronzer if you want. That may not be that deep, um, but you can try using number 10 to contour your face and stay tuned for our darker shades of bronzer. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and jump with this Jazzy Skin Tinted Moisturizer. And okay. You guys know that I have tried the Future Skin, and you're saying that this right here, the Tinted Moisturizer, has a little bit of more coverage, right, Angela? Yeah, it has a little bit more coverage than our Future Skin. So Future Skin is buildable coverage. So with Future Skin, the more layers you put on, you can control the heaviness of it. Whereas Just Skin, it's an easy on-the-go medium coverage. So one coat of Just Skin is actually more like two, two and a half coats of our Future Skin. But people like the Future Skin because it's oil-free, it's a gel, it's lightweight, and they can put it on really light for days they want something really light, or they can go a little heavier. So mm -hmm. um, it's all up to you. Hi, Marlene. So you're gonna do the Just Skin? Yes, I'm gonna do the Just Skin. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do, while you're doing that, I'm gonna do my Lestilo eyeliner, because I can't do an eye a smoky eye without my black liner. Yeah, I leave that and for last. <laughs> well, not last, but close mm -hmm. to last. Okay, I'm gonna do my I mascara to... last with you because that's that's the that's the that's the big one, the mm -hmm. mascara. And then they sent me right here the shade glow. Yeah. Have you tried? Have you? What color do you use in future skin? Cream. See, look. Don't we like a good uh, winged liner? So beautiful. You're good at it. I have hooded eyes and a lot of folds, so <laughs> it takes me time I have to, to do a winged liner. <laughs> I'm so used to I'm so I'm so used to putting this on, and I like that it's a felt tip because it dries faster than most. But that's my <laughs> this is my way of doing things. Is your yeah, foundation Steve. color sun tan? Yes, heavy on the chai. My foundation color is suntan, but you'll see in a second, I'm gonna blend banana and suntan because I like to highlight my face. Uh-oh, mm -hmm. are we buffering really bad? Uh, let's see, buffering in UK, bad buffering. No. Let mm. us know if you guys can see us better, when you guys can see yeah. us better. Let's see. Yeah, I don't see the comments moving. I think it's, it has to slow down a little. Okay, here we go. Uh, thank you, Chrissy, for being here. Thank you for coming. Uh, let's see. Please like. Okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah, please like the video. <laughs> thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. You're the best, guys. You guys <laughs> are. Can yeah. you guys can you guys see? Are we are we back are up we, and running? Yeah, we better. Somebody let us know. Are you going to expand the shade range in Jess's skin? It okay, so I've asked. Okay, let's talk about this. So Jess skin is a particular formula that's really hard for us to go. Ah, there we go. Look, you're you're a professional, Jacqueline. You've got the, I know. the, the pick <laughs> my first live, so I'm trying to like, what do I need to first, do here? Yes, your first live. <laughs> Cheers, girlfriend. So, anyways, the 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 just skin is a particular formula that's really hard to go dark without it being wrong. And I actually one of the first questions I asked Sylvie when I first met her was like, why can't we have just skin that's darker? However, we can't have the just skin that's darker without it being incorrect in shades. So instead, she decided to create other formulas and textures so that we can get the colors right. So unfortunately, just skin with that SPF that we use in there, it just, it just we can't get it right. 
I hope that, that answers your question, Leanne. Thank you. Thank you, Leanne. Okay. Hi, Jessica. Hi. Oh, hi, Jennifer. Well, two Jennifers right here. Okay. And you were telling me, so I have really bad under eye circles. Like they are really, I mean, you can tell like, <laughs> they are so dark. Oh, me too. I'm yeah. about to, I'm about to, okay, I'm going to take these off. So we can work on this is the, concealer is a girl's best friend. So let's talk. Let's talk about it. Let's work it out. Let's do mm -hmm. the concealer underneath. So you were saying, I'm sorry to interrupt you, Angela. No, go to, ahead. You that I, I'm able to use these right here under my eyes too, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what you what you can do? What I like to do is I like to take. Um, I like to put it on a little heavier and kind of let it sit and let that pig pigment sit so that when you go to press it in, you'll get a little bit more coverage. So take that underneath your eye, let it sit for a little bit, and then add your La Camo and a little heavier where you need it. I'm about to do the same thing with mm -hmm. my suntan and number eight. So suntan in future skin for me, number eight in real skin. I'm gonna go underneath my eyes. Okay. I just take the back of my brush and put a little on my hand as okay. a, I use so that as a palette. So clear. So I'm going to do this underneath. So you seen the camo one? You're, okay. You're using the look camo? Yes. I'm using suntan. And I'm okay, kind of I'm... piling it on underneath my eye just to give myself a little bit of coverage. I hope you guys can see that. Oh, I know. I wish that we had we were it was a little bit more clear so you guys can see. Hopefully, you guys can see a little bit. Do you see right there? I do have a lot of freckles, and what I noticed with these um, the just skin, I was able to achieve a little bit more coverage than with the future skin. So you can still see my freckles peeking through. It looks very natural and very like yeah. um, not super dewy, but it has a glow. And so for me, I like to I'm a, I like concealer, so I like to put a little bit more on underneath my eye, and then mm -hmm. I like to take it up underneath here just to give myself a little bit of a lift. Can you guys see the difference between this eye and this eye? You see all the darkness underneath here. Oh, I look grainy. Boo. Let's see. Angela, you look Okay. Aww. I see it clear. So it, I guess it will depend on the. Hmm. I mean, I see you clear. Oh, you see here. it clear. Okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, maybe Lisa. Um, Lisa Lisa's a, a good Lisa. colleague of mine, so. Okay. Maybe Lisa. Hopefully, hopefully it'll go in and out. Maybe you guys will get a, a little bit of a, a a good picture. But I mean, can you, hopefully you guys can see the difference between this side with no concealer and this side. I'm about to blend it down. Oh, there you go. A yes, it my does align. It makes a huge difference. Mm -hmm. So now I'm pressing it in. I'm using our foundation brush to kind of press it in. Now I'm going to do the other side. And it feels really lightweight. Very, very lightweight. Now I'm going to do this side now. Any other questions, you guys, while we're doing these concealers? Letting this, make, letting this work itself out? This camo concealer, in how many different shades does it come? So we have, it starts at zero, so we probably have about eight shades, maybe eight even shades. more. Yeah, about mm -hmm. eight shades, eight to nine shades in that, because we have 4C, 4W, 3C, 3W, so we have a couple of in-between shades. Mm -hmm. Good night, Allison. Thanks for joining us. Good night, Allison. Thank you so much. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with my concealer. Let's see, is oh. Shantikai, there's a question right here from Nilsa. 
She's asking, is Shantikai having the holiday 30% off soon? Yes, so what you have to do, it's for Cyber Week, which is right after Thanksgiving. So what you have to do is you go on to shantakai.com, sign up for our emails because you will get a special code through your email in order to be able to, to, to get that 30% off. So go sign up and you'll get the 30% off and it'll start um, right after Thanksgiving for Cyber Week. Oh no, I wish we were a little bit more clear, but that's okay, you guys. Okay. You guys, imagine what we look like. We're getting there. Can you guys see, can you guys at least see the shadows and the liner? Yeah. These colors are so beautiful. I wish My you guys goodness, the eyeshadow looks incredible on you, Angela. You can see incredible. it good. I mean, I see it. It looks see it amazing really on you too. I'm gonna use like a little it. bit of this powder. Now, is this powder? I heard that this powder was gonna become permanent. Um, it is going to be permanent, mm -hmm. and I will give you guys a hint. We are also creating another shade, a little bit darker in that powder. So yes. we, it was supposed to be temporary, and it, you see, it's got the hummingbirds on it. It was supposed to be temporary for the hummingbird collection, but you guys loved it so much in July that Sylvie decided she wanted to keep it and create another one. So you'll see it soon coming back. It just won't be in this packaging because this packaging went to support the hummingbirds. It'll just mm -hmm. be part of our permanent collection and we'll have another added color. So hang tight, you guys. There are a few of these um, in some blue mer mercury locations. So if you mm -hmm. guys still want this, you can contact us on live chat and we'll be able to contact whichever store still has a couple because I know there was a couple people that wanted some today and we ordered them in Blue Mercury in Florida. So they're around, but they they won't be around for long, but they'll come back up probably by next week. Yeah, and this is such a beautiful powder. It's very, very lightweight. It doesn't emphasize it fine lines. I mean, it even blurs like by large pores so good and the people who knows me and are my subscribers they know that i don't powder all my face but with this one i feel like nothing happens you know it's like so good so just saying actually, that it's better right now okay i'm gonna use Thank the you, serena you're gonna use serena as me my, too. As, me my too. as my setting yeah 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 me too i'm gonna use sirena Guys, this has a little bit more of like a golden undertone, right? Because gold, I feel, yeah. is a little bit more like warm, a little bit more reddish in tone. Is that right? Yes. Yeah, and it looks good on a really nice dark tan skin. But I've also mm -hmm. seen people that have more of a pinker undertone in their skin being being and fair being able to use Goa as their bronzer. Mm -hmm. But I'm using Serena as my powder because I like that it gives me a little bit of a glow without being too, too heavy. So that's what mm -hmm. I'm using all over. Yeah. Yes, that pow powder is the Holy Grail. It is, it is. Um, there was another question. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, does the Chantecai loose powder work well? I hear great things about the press one, but wondering about that one. The loose powder for those that love a good old fashioned loose powder is wonderful. I personally am always on the go and I prefer pressed. I enjoy the pressed powder, but if you love a loose powder, you'll love subtle is a great color. I don't know what your, your tone is, um, can be creations, but uh, subtle is usually a pretty universal loose powder. We also have another loose powder that's coming up that comes in a little pump and it also uh, let me think of that i can it'll come to me in just a second I, I, it's, it's escaped me but we have another loose powder that has a little bit of a glow that's all in one it's a brush and powder in one it's a two in one but if you want the loose kind of the old school loose powder that comes in like a container then we have that in subtle so hopefully that answers your question. But I will suggest that if you go on live chat, 
you can book a one-on-one -on -one consultation with any one of us. There's so many of us talented Shantakai artists that can do one-on-ones and we can kind of walk you through what's best for you by looking at you, whether it's FaceTime, whether it's Zoom. So just let us know, Call, go on live chat and book whatever is most um, convenient for you. Yeah, I think that's a great future right there. You Lisa P, mm -hmm. um, will there be an additional products in the holistic line? Do you mean um, the CBD or are you talking about the rose line? Maybe if you give me a little bit more and I'll be able to answer that for you. I don't see her question. You said Lisa? It's um, Lisa P. Okay. It was a little bit above the loose powder question. Oh, okay, so, okay, okay. So then I need to go. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. There you go. Yes, there we go. Yes, okay. Okay, the let's coded. see. She just give us a little bit of a hit right here. I have the code in the description box. Is it working? Does it start later or tomorrow? Are you using, hey, it's Jacqueline? Mm -hmm. um, because it should be working and it may start tomorrow when the eyeshadows drop. We'll also have a landing page for you guys to click. So try again later, but definitely it will work tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We have Elaine. Look what she says. When I use these products, I feel so good. And in turn, my makeup looks amazing, even if I see myself. <laughs> That's amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm so That's glad. Yeah. I mean, our, our skincare is amazing. So whatever, however you start will uh, definitely create the canvas for a beautiful, uh, beautiful makeup. So that's the thing I love about our skincare and our line in general. Now, Angela, does the loose powder has a little bit of luminosity or is completely matte? The loose powder in our original formula, Subtle, mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. completely matte, but we do mm -hmm. candlelight. I knew I would remember it. We have another one that's a loose powder in a little pump brush. I wish I had one here to show you guys, but it has a little brush. It's called candlelight and there's a little bit of a glow. Ooh, we, I feel like we look really, really um, clear all of a sudden. Hopefully you guys, yep, Romero said it, candlelight. Thank you. Um, it's beautiful. So yeah. hopefully, can you guys see us better now? I hope so, because I feel like I can see us better, clearer right now. Uh, this, there was another one that asked about our new foundation that's coming out. Are you putting oh, on yes. oh, your I eyes? Was, I, good. I was going to ask for that too, the new foundation. Let's see, where is okay. that question? Oh, I, I know, everybody's now. super excited about it. I can't find it. I saw it, but I'm going to go ahead and answer the question because I know that I saw it just a second ago. So, ah, here it is. LJ, is there a new foundation coming out? It's right on, above the KMD Creations. Is there a new foundation coming out? I've been hearing whispers. You have heard whispers and you've probably seen it in our Asian market. So mm -hmm. it is a... Um, cushion makeup we're releasing a cushion makeup which is amazing but we had to work on the darker shades because we wanted to get the darker shades right but the 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 lighter shades came out perfectly so we went ahead and released them in the asian market first and then the darker shades with the full line will be released in the uk and the us at the top of next year so it's mm -hmm. coming it's a cushion makeup i've actually been using it it's um, it's just a lighter weight kind of water-based makeup. It's beautiful, and it, okay. and it has a very light coverage. Light coverage. In fact, I I wanted to. There's a question right here. The Shantikai has a full coverage foundation that works well with mature skin. I would say that the full coverage would be the future skin. The the way you're gonna get a full coverage from this makeup is by using it and building it up. So between using this and then adding maybe some real skin if you need to, this is going to be your best because it's gel and it's lightweight. What are you doing over here, Jacqueline? You're putting I, on uh, some more. <laughs> I'm putting a little bit of this under my eye now. Now I need to finish oh, my cute. eyes. Okay, I like it. It looks so pretty. It's such a pretty, like, I like you use both colors. And then you started off with that color as the base. It's so pretty. 
and I'm gonna darken it out. I'm gonna go to Crane right now. Le Lexi Jung, you asked if there's any plans to make a slightly lighter version of Perfect Blur. The best for you is our HD powder. I don't know if you've used our plain HD powder, but it's lighter and it's beautiful. And it blurs just like Perfect Blur, but it's a lot lighter. So I even can use it. I'm a little oilier, so I can have a tendency to like a, um, I have a tendency to like a more uh, matte finish. So I can go with the HD powder even on my skin. So hopefully that answers your question. It is. Let's see. I see that there's a lot more people now right here on the live. So welcome everybody. I see Breed Clark right here too. Hi Breed. Hi Shay. Okay, let's see. More questions awesome. right here. Now, does the new cushion foundation have skin benefits? Absolutely. You'll see that the cushion makeup just with any of our, I mean, even our future skin, we have aloe, we have chamomile, it helps with redness. It's very good. So there's going to be all kinds of skincare benefits in the cushion makeup. And I think that's what makes cushion so unique. The formula is supposed to be a skincare with the foundation all in one. So you're definitely going to get both. And we will come out with a whole like tidbits on what it all does. I don't want to speak on that just yet because I haven't memorized all the different things that it does for the skin, but it definitely will have skincare built into the foundation, which is what what's what's very great about it. Yay, we're finally very clear. Mm -hmm. Maybe I could do some mascara finally, you guys. That's going to be my luck. Got to get some mascara on, you guys. So beautiful. I'm and using oh, right now, by the way, Crane thing? again. Okay. Are you are you're going in with yeah, crane? With crane and I'm okay. trying to use it kind of like an eyeliner. Like for my under eyes with a little bit of this rose de May water. Just to make it a little bit deeper. And it's gonna look very glam, very shiver. I'm actually gonna take the this uh I'm gonna use my eye blend brush and I'm gonna smoke out the uh, eyeliner just to give myself a little different of a look. Since we've seen that, I'm gonna take the eyeliner and kind of smoke it out on the outer corner. Let's see. And then um, add eyeliner. So you see how I was able to deepen it out with the rose water? I'm using the wrong one, here we go. Okay. Yes, I'm glad Lexi brought that up. But bought Thanks. it because I think you're really gonna like it, and I I seen your Instagram page, so I think you're really gonna enjoy that HD powder. Now this beautiful collection, the holiday collection, we have two of these. Are there gonna be any like lip veils coming out soon? Well, or... actually, we're not gonna have lip veils. If we're having this new hint hint lip crayons, so they'll be fine. There's probably one, I think there's five shades in total to mm -hmm. be out um, for at the end. So probably closer to late November, early December. So there'll be five new shades of um, kind of a semi-matte lip crayon. So you guys should look out for those, some vibrant colors and some more natural colors. I am currently putting on, okay, good. I'm glad we answered your question. Um, I'm putting on our Longa Slash Mascara. Um, and I'm gonna use La Stilo liner. I love the La Stilo. Are you using it in black? Yes, in black. Mm -hmm. How many colors so does it come in? Black, brown? It has black and brown, and then we have some other kind of fun colors that have a little bit of a different brush, um, but the two main colors in our original La Stilo come in brown and black. I like black when I'm doing a dramatic look. But look, look, look at the difference in both my eyes with mascara and without mascara. This mascara, mascara is awesome. So let me talk about a little bit about our longest lash mascara. So our longest lash mascara is a blend of rose oils and wonderful peptides that help boost the lash. So I have brittle lashes because I 
probably don't drink enough water. I take a lot of allergy medicine. I live in Houston. It's so humid here that I have a lot of allergies to like uh, mold and things like that. So I feel like I'm always rubbing my eyes. I wear contacts sometimes when I'm not wearing my um, uh, contacts. So with this, I like using the longest lash because it makes my lashes feel really touchable. And then when I wiggle, the mascara at the base of my lash, I'm getting all those peptides really close. So I find for me that my lashes um, tend to stay in a little bit longer, grow better, they don't fall out as much as they normally would. So for me, my, I noticed that my lashes have grown extremely with this mascara. And I just think it's the, the blend of not having, if you smell the mascara, once you put it on, Jacqueline, you'll notice mm -hmm. that it's um, like, it smells like roses. So you don't have the tar and the alcohol that you typically would have in a regular mascara. And then you also don't have the drying out that mascara does. So I mean, I don't, hopefully you guys, I'm gonna take um, a second to let us clear up just in case I'm buffering and see if I can find, while she's putting on her eyeliner, I'm gonna see if I can find. I, um, let's see, I'm so fair, Crane would be too deep on me. Then you should try you you should try doing the zebra. The zebra would probably be very beautiful on you, Reina. Um, yes, zebra is definitely more peachy. Does zebra have a more pe pink or peach tone? I think it's a hybrid of both. I wouldn't call it pink. I think it's more rose gold, if that makes sense, Reina. Yeah, um, it's more rose gold. Mm -hmm. I agree mm -hmm. with you. Um, Debbie asked, do you have a vitamin C? The sunscreen is amazing on dark skin. Totally. I guess the, that sunscreen is the bomb on darker skin because it doesn't have the white cast and it's oil free and it's water resistant and you can also use it as a foundation primer. So that's amazing. And we, we have, we don't have a vitamin C per se, but we have things that have vitamin C S things in them. Like we have our Rose de May um, moisturizer. We have our vital essence. What is it that you're wanting your vitamin C to do Debbie? And then I can maybe elaborate a little bit more. Um, Lisa, she says, which color are you wearing on your eyes? I'm wearing the crane. Lisa, which is this color here. On the inner corner of my eye, I have the zebra. So here, I took amethyst eyeliner, which is here, and then our black liner. So that's, and then I put our mascara on this eye. So that's why this one looks a little darker. And then I smudged everything underneath my eyes. Hopefully that answers the question. And okay. the sunscreen, yes, Debbie, yes, I, that that sunscreen is amazing on darker skin. Oh, okay, so, what? Uh, who else has something for for us? I'm so tired. Yes, then. The spa nation, yes, it's humid, honey. Humid. Mm -hmm. I'm hot now. Okay. Let's see. Um, what else? Yes, the mascara is the best on the market. The difference when I use yours versus another brand is night and day. Lashes are softer and longer when I use it. I'm with you because my lashes are really normally very, very short and brittle, and they feel so soft when I'm using this. Yeah, so this mascara basically boosts your lashes, right? It will make it's kind of like a hybrid between the mascara and uh yeah, and like a it's lash because serum. it's got peptides in it. It's like a mm -hmm. it's like a it's like skincare for your lashes. So it's got mm -hmm. boosters in it, it's got a blend of rose oil and different peptides in it that helps your lashes look and boost and, and feel their best, right? And for me, I've noticed that I, we can't necessarily make the claim that it grows your lashes, but mm -hmm. anyone that's used this mascara will all tell you that they see a great difference in their mascara. Yeah, I'm gonna let you show yours. Mine looks all gross because I have my 
greasy little fingers. This is new for me. This is the first time that I'm right. going to try yeah. these yes, mascara. I'm because, excited for you to try it. Yeah, because I, I first thought, okay, well, now is it supposed to give, okay, here is the bristle right here. Okay, there you go. Sorry, guys. There you, there you go. go. There you go. Okay, so it's supposed to be like more like volume, give you volume or just length. It does a both. little bit of both. It's, it's lengthening and volumizing. I wiggle at the base, so I like to give myself the volume when I start out at the base, and then it definitely gives you length um, when you extend it out. So I am one of those people that I like to use mascara at least two to three times before I feel like I can really work with the mascara. I need to let mm -hmm. air kind of hit it a little bit, and I feel like you'll truly love this mascara the second time you use it kind of have to get a feel for it because it doesn't have all those additives in it that you're used to in normal mascara so you kind of have to get used to how it feels when it first goes on because it's so touchable and it's so layerable i hope that mm -hmm. makes sense and now it's good to use on the uh, lower lashes right absolutely absolutely yes for sure mm -hmm. um okay so, so lisa barnett said what skincare do you recommend for texture and detoxing the pores. Girl, I have so much that I could tell you right now. There's a detox clay mask, that's one. Um, the other thing for texture that I would suggest is retinol. Number one, retinol, let me let me go through the, the list for you because I have those issues, that's why I can relate. So I would do retinol at night. I would do uh, Rose de May moisturizer during the day. And then I would do detox clay mask once or twice a week. And I can go through that a little more in depth if you want to do like a one-on-one -on -one, or if you want to DM me on my uh, Instagram and I can go back and forth with you because I can look at your, um, I, I can look at your pictures and kind of give you a better idea, but uh, definitely reach out. But those are the three products that I would probably suggest because the retinol works wonders and the niacinamide inside our Rose de May cream is amazing. So that combo in itself with some detox clay mask will get your skin looking fabulous. Mm -hmm. On the description box, I will be leaving uh, your Instagram, Angela. Is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Come. Mm -hmm. it, uh, it, and it's a long Instagram. It's um, H. -t oh, wait, hold on. What is mine? I'm so tired. I can't even think. H Town Mommy Makeup Artist. So um, yeah, it's a long that. one. <laughs> I remember the first time that I was trying to look you up through Instagram. I was, you know, typing Angela Bartel, and it's like it's yeah, yeah. Hearing. <laughs> So Yadi, you said that your code is only working for ten dollars. Will they automatically add the GWP? What is that? I'm confused. The code is only working for ten dollars. I'm um, so you can't buy anything more than ten dollars. Uh, maybe ask me ask that question again so I can understand a little bit more. Yeah. Okay. No. So the the so I see it again here. Is there a spending amount? So for, to get that gift, let me show you while we're, while she's doing her eyes, let me show you all the things that are inside this gift. So you can understand all these beautiful, wonderful things. So as we were talking about the patch, you get one of these, you get a mini mascara longest lash. You also get a, gold, a mini gold recovery mask. So you'll get all that inside of here with a sale of 200. But if you just use, hey, it's Jacqueline, just to show some love, um, anything under 200, they'll just know that you tuned in and watched this um, wonderful live with both of us on here. So you can join, the, you, you can give her some love by doing that. But if you spend 200 or more, you get this. And then, you know, if you do the raffle, you get all these wonderful things. Mm -hmm. Does it make yes. sense? And then the sale mm -hmm. is gonna be good until this coming Sunday, right? Yeah. Yes. So, so we're going Sundays. till Sunday. Yeah, mm -hmm. so for those of you guys that did, came in and joined us late, you will be able to um, kind of go back in and look at through all of our uh, random talks that we did and maybe other <laughs> questions that we asked. Um, you can go in and look at it and you will have until Sunday to be able to use that. Um, also, you can, yeah, and then the gifts are good. I mean, we usually don't give such great 
GWPs, and this is an awesome one. So if you have anything that you want, this is the time to get it. You'll have it till Sunday. Otherwise, you can sign up for um, the sale that we'll have for Cyber Week. Mm -hmm. But in order to get the code for Cyber Week, you have to be um, signed up for our emails. That's so funny. (laughs) There you go, Crystal. Okay, and then for the code, again, I mean, it's the name of my channel right there. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then we have a beautiful comment right here. I love, let's see. I love the clay mask with honey. That's my favorite, girl. Mm -hmm. If I have it, my colleagues, I have it right here. This detox clay mask with honey. It's amazing because it's one of the only clay masks that's out here that does not dry down. You know how a lot of these clay masks dry down and irritate the skin? This stays uh, nice and emollient the whole time that it's on your face. It's, it's purifying. It's rosemary. It's honey. Amazing. It's, a, it's one of my favorite go-tos. I've been using it several times a week. I even do it as a spot check on my face. Mm. So what what are we doing now? So I'm going to be using the zebra right now. And I'm going to just put it a little bit kind of like what you did on the inner corner. Yeah. Just to brighten it up that area. So pretty. Look at that. Mm -hmm. The contrast of both of them is beautiful because the crane one does have a little bit of uh, pink sparkles in it. So it's mainly like a beautiful purple tone, but it does have a little bit of pink sparkles in it so using it together is just like they are meant to be together <laughs> now i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and since i think you guys have looked at me without mascara on one side of my face long enough i'm gonna go ahead and do my mascara on the other side now yeah and look at me right here i do i have put some on my lower lashes too i don't know if you guys can see it it gave me a lot of like length and separation but I can keep building on it, right? If I want to. Yeah, absolutely. Well, see, I, you know, this, mine's a little older of a tube. You can tell there's a lot of it wear and tear. Mine doesn't look as pretty as yours because my hands have all kinds of moisturizer that have been on there, but mine's got a little bit of air. I, I love this and just as a, a side note. My favorite is when the mascara, this mascara gets a little older and it gets mm-hmm. that, that formula gets a little thicker because I live in Texas. Everything's bigger in Texas. We want lots of <laughs> mascara. I want lots of mascara. So I like it to be nice and thick so I can, you know, really work that mascara and get a real maximum effect, which I think um, you'll notice. Okay. So I think perhaps the code will be working tomorrow. I don't know. Yes. Here if, we have- if not, if, if mm-hmm. it's not working tonight, you guys work in the, in the morning. If it's still not working for you, lo- log into the live chat and someone will help you with it. And they'll say my code from the, the live last night isn't working and they'll help you. Cause maybe I'm assuming they might have loaded it for tomorrow just because we're featuring these eyeshadows and these eyeshadows go live tomorrow morning. So I yeah, think if it's not working sense. tonight, you guys will ha- it'll it'll be ready for you guys in the morning. And if there's any problem in the morning, either reach out to myself or go on live chat and have them fix it for you because they'll be working live chat in the morning. Thank you, Alpha C, okay. for being here. She has to leave us. Bye. Aww, thank you for being thank here. Thank you for love. joining us. Thank you. I'm thank you so pow- much. I'm gonna do a little bit of powder. And then I'm going to do a little lips. Okay, I'm going to go with some blush right here. So I know Mm -hmm. you guys have... I have a question. Do you have the happy blush? Yes, I do. I do, I do, I do. I want to to see what this happy blush looks like on you. Just because I've seen it on people. And every time I see this being put on, you you don't have the happy blush? I have lively. Lively is fine. Either one of those. Either one. Okay. Lively is good. Yes. So what I want, because I'm going to put on the cheek jelly in Vibrant, and I want to show you a trick with this that I don't ever see anyone ever doing. Put it on your ring fingers and tap it onto your cheeks. Okay. Because everyone wants to use a brush with this, and I find that the best way to apply this is 
with your fingers. Just use your ring finger. Here you go. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to get used to where. <laughs> okay. So this one right here is more like a peachy tone, the one that I have, lively. Yours is more like a pinkier tone. Is that My, right? Yeah, more rosy. Mine is rosy. more rosy. There you go. And so that's the color that I put on this cheek. Okay. So it's brand new. <laughs> <laughs> She's just opening it up. So I'm, yep. I'm going to walk her through it. So put it on, like, put it on your, like, ring finger. Oh, the ring finger. Okay. Yeah, ring finger. All right. Because I want you, I'm going to have you tap it onto your skin like this. Okay, my friends. Where is the mirror? <laughs> it just disappeared, my mirror. <laughs> okay, here you I go. Know. I got it. So you, see. yeah, so yeah. And now take your cheek, uh, cheek and just tap it in with your with your ring finger. Just tap it right, right onto your skin. Press it. Like press this. it. Okay, hold on. Like I think I put too much. Press, press, press. Yes, like press, press, press. Yeah, press it. And you get like more that? color this way. Yes, like that. There you go. You get more payoff this way. Yeah, mm -hmm. because if you put it on with the brush, you almost lose the color payoff. And I've noticed people putting this on with a brush and I'm like, no, no, use your fingers. I know everyone has all these amazing brushes and they want to put it on with the brush, but it's really, really, really uh, best to put it on with your fingers. Yes, Morgan, isn't it the best? Hi, Morgan. So good to have you here. Oh my goodness. Awesome. I see so that many friends. Brush. You know what, <laughs> friends? Listen, I have been very nervous for this chat. <laughs> you can only imagine. <laughs> so I got right here oh, a look. disco sour. Have to cheer. And have, <laughs> cheers. And I have a kombucha. I'm not as, uh, as fabulous. Cheers, Jacqueline. I'm not cheers, as fabulous. Dear. I'm drinking kombucha. I've had a long day. So cheers, <laughs> my friend. Cheers. Cheers on your first amazing live my friend i know thank you so much i mean like this is a dream i'm all like to all my friends pinch me please <laughs> i'm going left i know all friend. we're doing is playing in makeup wow. and you guys are watching us it's amazing yes, it's amazing and showcasing these new beautiful pieces yeah so exciting i'm gonna put some more of this powder on because i'm getting shiny because those that know houston know what time it is when we get shiny and i'm using our our the this this the perfect blur because it's the bomb even though we don't have it for sale currently it's coming back so just hang tight okay now if i want to go over top with a little bit of um yeah you can put the blush over the top of it yeah yeah so put okay. whichever blush you want over the top of it mm -hmm. that you have this blush is ladylike. She doesn't like aggressive brushes. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny, Crystal. It is. It's very, it's very dainty. It's mm -hmm. crystal. It's very, very dainty. That's what we do here. Put it on very dainty like. But yes. But the this the thing about the it, this is nice. The eyeshadows are nice and aggressive. Oh, so you're doing whale shark from the summer mm -hmm. collection. Isn't this gorgeous? Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. This is beautiful. Now, on the small blushes, the ones that they come single, how many different mm -hmm. shades do you guys have of that one? We probably have, let me see, we probably have five or six of different shades, and they each go through a different, like, so we have the butterfly, we have the turtle, we have the horse, we have the elephant, and we have the bee. So five, five different shades. One of my colleagues might tell me that, oh, and we have horse. Did I say horse? So we may have six shades, and then each shade goes to a specific organization, organization. that we support. So it's always bringing some sort of awareness to anything that we're doing. So whether mm -hmm. it's the bees, and or it's uh, the wild horses of North America, or if it's the elephants, which is my spirit animal that I love, we're always mm -hmm. bringing some sort of awareness. Oh, so cheers. Sweet. Congratulations, Thank Jacqueline. And thanks for the two. Thank of course, what we're here for. Here we go. We have Debbie. I think she has a question right here. Angela, what color blush would you recommend for deep skin? Vibrant girlfriend. 
vibrant cheek jelly looks really really good I'm, I'm pretty sure you can't really see it that well on here tonight but this looks good on even the darkest deepest lupita nyango shades it's so beautiful and then what i like about it is the fact that you're able to put it on bare skin if you want um other uh, our other blushes look great but it really depends on how hydrated you are how oily you are for the grab and the color payoff so unless I have a one-on-one -on -one with a darker skin tone right now, I don't want to like suggest the other shades because I've noticed that sometimes when you're drier and you're darker, some of the powder blushes aren't the best bet. But this will work on a dark skin tone. Fatima, our model that we used for this last fall and also this last um, campaign that we did, she's a little bit darker than myself and she's able to use that as well. So hopefully that answers you, Debbie. Okay, so we're going into lips now. Let's see yeah, we're doing lips. There's a question from Ika, E-K-A. Angela, yes, I, want hi, Ika. To, I want to try, try eye treatments, I think, from Shantakai. Should I try the serum or eye concentrate first? Thank you. Okay, so my response to that is, if you have an eye cream that you're using, then do the uh, the eye serum. But if you don't have it, eye cream is like number one. If you if you can't do anything else, it's SPF and eye cream. If you have an eye cream that you like and you're not in love with, I suggest doing a serum underneath your eye cream. If you don't have an eye cream, then I would get an eye cream first. I hope that answers that question, but that's the the order of events that I would suggest for you to do. Okay, good, good. What lip color are you putting on? Okay, are so I just swatch, I have right here, let's see, I have on top right here, Plumeria, mm -hmm. and then here I have Acacia. So this is from the full collection. I did a full on review on these products right here with the entire collection, beautiful collection. And I don't know, I think, Hold on. Something just went on. Okay. I think I'm going to go. And I was like, what's going to With Acacia. I think I'm going to go with Acacia. Okay. I'm going to start off with, I'm going to start off with Chic Lip Liner, which is one of my favorite lip liners. There you go. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start off with a, there, and I don't know which color I'm going to do first. Yeah. I don't have a lip liner. liner from you guys. So, yeah. I, I, so I'm gonna skip the lip liner. So I'm okay, just gonna go straight. Okay. It should it should be fine. It should be fine. I only like lip liner because I have a lot of pigment in my lips naturally. So oh, I like mine to too. do. I like to do lip liner because I like to differentiate where my face starts and my lips starts. So I like a little no matter what, unless I'm doing red. Red is the only time I really don't wear a lip liner. Yeah, Marcella, Jacqueline, work. I can get the blush highlighter duo. It's a gorgeous and I need it in my life. Do you still have it on Shatakai's website? Uh, we are sold out, my friend. Um, it was such a great, great combo. Um, mm -hmm. It was a summer collection. Hopefully they'll bring it back. Um, anytime we create a product, the great thing about being part of a family owned company is that if they see that you like it and they see that there's a demand for it, they always try to reintroduce it and bring it back. Just like the Soleil that we originally came out with, with that collection a few summers ago, people loved it so much. They decided to create a, a, a whole collection that's now permanent. So yeah, by the way, strong direction. This full, these, all of these shadows will be permanent within the collection. So that's the great thing about this. Oh, so those will be permanent. Yes. Great. Great. Okay. Wonderful. Now, how, how did Shantikai, I mean, like, I know Sylvie, she's the founder, like how she started, mm -hmm. you know, like what was her idea behind it? How she got inspired? How did she said, let's do a skincare beauty company? So I, I think I think the interesting the interesting thing about her whole story is what I love about it. So her and Diane von Furstenberg were really good friends and they had a little store in New York and the Lauder family approached them and said, you know, they had little things. They had like an apothecary within their store and the Lauder family approached Sylvia and said, hey, do you want to create a line? 
And then in pops prescriptives. Who doesn't remember prescriptives cosmetics, yes. right? Yes, so yes. she helped create prescriptives for the Lauder family. So she had, uh, she created the help create that whole line. And mm-hmm. the only thing that's really left is that one fragrance. Somebody helped me remember the name of that fragrance. Uh, now it's part of the prescriptives line. It's called, uh, it starts with a C. Someone might remember. But um, also, she created that line and so she decided she wanted to create something more natural so about 20 years ago before natural was the thing she wanted to do that i know she had some uh, health issues and she knew that natural was what she wanted to do and she created started creating like jasmine and lily healing mask and things that were natural and she started actually with fragrances because fragrances are very nostalgic and it's the aromatherapy in it so she started there and it slowly expanded and look where we are today not who would have thought that she was on the forefront of creating cosmetics that were natural and holistic and better for you and and mm-hmm. now it's grown into this global amazing company and she still kept it family owned her husband still runs the finances her daughter alex Shantikai, who i was texting with earlier today still is the vp of sales the son does all of our visual he's our photographer philippe oh. olivia's the face of the line they created baby lines when, when they introduced their first grandbaby to the family. So it's a really a family-owned company that has just grown based on me and evolved through time. How beautiful. I, and I know they have expanding their brick and mortar stores in Asia, right? Yeah, yeah. So a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of the Asian culture, they love skincare and they love doing different steps in skincare. And they've really taken on to our skincare. So we've really expanded kind of first. Our first brick and mortar store was um, in is in Hong Kong. And it's a beautiful store in Hong Kong. That's the only freestanding store that we have. Otherwise, we're in Neiman Marcus. We're in Bergdorf Goodwin. Goodman, I can't talk at this point in the night. We're in um, Blue Mercury, Nordstrom, Certain Sacks, uh, Cosbar, even, um, and different places uh, globally in Australia, the UK, and Europe. So, single, I, I don't know if we're in Singapore, we're in Taiwan and Korea. So, there's just different places that we are, are with. So, yes. Prescriptives Custom Foundations. Yes, Spa Nation, you remember that. Calyx, there you go. Calyx is the fragrance that's still around that is part of um, Clinique. Thank you. I was having there like a go. brain fog this evening. Awesome. Okay, and then we have here somebody comment, Lilette, soul color should be permanent too. <laughs> Yeah, that's oh, a beautiful one. Do, yeah. Are there any plans to bring it back? I or? mean, there might be. There might be. If there's enough people that want Soleil to come back, I'm sure Soleil would come back. So keep talking. There's different things that I want to come back to. There's I have my requests all the time, like matte chic lipsticks, but we won't go there tonight because, you know, those were one of my favorites. I'm hoping they come back too. So we mm-hmm. all have our, our our favorites. But if we we scream loud enough, Sylvia will hear it and bring it in. Yes, Spa Nation. Calyx is that favorite. Calyx is yeah. the one. Yes. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Brian, right there. And by the way, I mean, like, I'm so grateful with the entire team of Shantikai, with you, Angela, with Scott. I mean, like, anytime that I have been trying to get my hands on something that has been limited edition or is not anymore available online. Um, I don't know. uh, I mean, I have contacted Angela or Scott and they have helped me to find it. So I'm I'm pretty sure they they will help you out. (laughs) Yes, we will. You're looking for something. Uh You're looking for something. We're going to find it for you. Somebody has it somewhere. and We'll be more than happy to help you. Locate it, especially when we're in stores. I was in Blue Mercury in the Woodlands today, so they had some. You know, anytime they have limited items that no one's gotten because no one has been in the store, I'm always trying to post it on my Instagram. And I've sold a lot of things. I'll walk in a store and it's like, you know, oh my God, they have this left. And I had there was like three perfect blurs one day, and I posted it on my Instagram and we sold out of it. So I'm always here to help. Um, I think someone asked me about my skincare routine. Let me show you what I'm doing while you're, while we're doing that. I'm going to show you the things that I'm using. 
because they're here. Bio serum, radiance elixir, and currently, but it's coming back, our CBD cream. I am always getting irritated by either touching my face or the mask that have caused me mask me right here. So I think this combination for an oily skin and a humid climate is perfect. So this has been my morning routine. This has been my nighttime routine. And I now that it's starting to not be summer anymore, I always add retinol because retinol helps resurface my skin. And then it also helps me, my skin stay clear. I still That's get adult Reginald. acne at 40. Reginald. So this is my skincare mm -hmm. routine. Mm -hmm. We're both 40, girl. Oh, you, are you, did you, are how, you're 42? Mm-hmm, oh, 1979. You're <gasps> Keep it secret. You're, you're, oh, you're still 39. I haven't claimed. No, 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 I said 1979. Oh, okay, so I'm 1980, so I turned 40 this year during COVID. So I'm, because it's 2020 and it was during a pandemic, I'm still 39, okay? Okay, That's what perfect. We're yeah, because this year is canceled, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We have to cheers for I'll that. I'll turn because... 40 again next year. Yes, cheers. Mm -hmm. I'll I'll turn 40 again next year. I promise. My goodness, this crazy year. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, I would love see, the Vital Essence with Arbutin to come back. Let me just tell you about the Vital Essence with Arbutin. People are into instant gratification, and sometimes they don't want to wait on. The Arbutin, so the Vital Essence, so the Spa Nation was making a comment about this um, Vital Essence with Arbutin that we used to have that helped with um, discoloration. We now have another product called Blanc Gardenia. Can you believe that I have all this stuff like at my, in, in front of me? Oh, wow. sorry, I'm turning it the wrong direction. No, this way. There we go. And this way. There we go. So Blanc Gardenia took, uh, took the place of the, the Vital Essence with Arbutin. So what it does is it, it attacks any hyperpigmentation that we have. Any, uh, anytime there's a cluster of um, overproduction of melanin, that's the stem cells in the Blanc Gardenia is what helps with that. So try this, Spa Nation. You might like it. Just saying. Okay, let's see. So there's another question about the Safari collection. It seems like it's sold out everywhere. Oh my goodness. I, I personally I, can keep I you posted. Say it, well, say I know it, there's yeah. a couple. I, I know where there's a couple um, uh, fall Safari collections. I think there's, there's three in Houston. So message me later. Um, and I will tell, put you in contact with the store that has them. I think Neiman Marcus, Austin has a, one or two. I think Neiman Marcus, San Antonio may have one. And then a Blue Mercury somewhere in Houston has one. So message me. I'll put you in contact with the store that has one. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Let's see. Here's just in case I'm gonna put it right here on the screen so you know Angela's IG. Thank you so much, Yadi. Yes, oh, amazing. I know you're doing so great. Thank you. Thank so, you um, so someone much. else is asking if we're having if we're having any additional um, holiday line products, and the holiday line products that we're coming out with are those extra those new five lip crayons. Um, we, we decided to take it a little light, but what I like for holiday are, I don't know if you guys remember these beautiful lip crystals. Like, <laughs> who did not remember how beautiful <laughs> these lip crystals are? We brought some out just for, you know, a little while. They produced a couple more in three different shades. I'm using the rose quartz over plumeria and cheek today. So get these while they're available because they're, I mean, look at this formula. Who doesn't want, hold on, I'm going in the wrong direction. Let's see. This way. There we go. Who doesn't want this beautiful, beautiful shade of like glitz and glitter? And they don't feel too glittery on. I'm actually just going to put it right there in the middle. That is so beautiful. These, I'm actually going to wear also rose quartz. 
are you? I love yeah, this color. This is so I just love that the red, there's a beautiful deep plum and there's a beautiful carnelian uh, red, but I wear red all the time. You guys see me in red all the time. So I decided to kind of tone it down. I mean, if we're going to go glittery, let's go glittery and not in a little bit nude. It's such mm -hmm. a pretty, pretty color. Yeah. Can you guys see that in the middle? This I don't think you guys gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I love it. And I'm not a gloss gal. So um, glosses for me are not, I like glitz without the gloss, probably because I'm so shiny all the time. But I like the fact that this gives me that little bit of glitz without having to be so shiny. It's yeah. Clary says I'm from Jamaica. How can I get those products? There are, I believe um, there are some, you have to, Met, personal message me and I can tell you the different retail retailers that send to Jamaica. We came out with the Hummingbird collection for spring and we had a lot of um, people from Jamaica because I found out that the Hummingbird is Jamaica's national bird. So we had a lot of Jamaicans that wanted this collection just because of the Hummingbird on here. So there's some retailers that um, send to Jamaica, um, but just message me and I'll get it to you. Had to cancel this trip. Love Jamaica. Awesome. Oh, yes, hopefully you can get them in your car and then you can check out Eileen Wallace Beauty. I'll put them in their car tonight, just waiting for the code so I can yes. check out. Awesome. Yay. Try in the morning, you guys. Try in the morning. Now you were yes, talking about foundation is a personal beauty mm -hmm. i was just saying the spawnation does everything i'm like what what happened to this and then he comes calyx yeah he knows, he knows yeah, he's like he's, he knows. <laughs> he's like he's like he's the person in class with all the answers he's got the yeah. answers go for it, i go love for it. that product we, i'll look we into love Ryan. get a sample of it try and see if somebody can give you a sample of it and message me because i might have some sample packets that i could send you okay we'll get we'll get you something now for fragrance, do you have something with tuberose perhaps? We do. Why is tuberose such a big, like, you know, you're the fourth person that's asked me that question. If we have a fragrance, tuberose. tuberose. <laughs> that's so funny. The tuberose that we have is actually not in Darby Rose. It's either in Patal or TR, um, which was what we have. I actually have a little bit. It is in Patal. And it's gardenia based with a little bit of tuberose undertone in it. Who asked that question? I'm so curious. Why? What's this new infatuation with tuberose this, these days? Oh, tuberose I just want to is know. so beautiful. I, I love it. It is beautiful. The, the brilliant glow. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here you, go. you know, Here I'm going to be extra. Glass. I'm just going to put some. <laughs> But I know yeah, no. um, Angelina Jolie make these glosses right here so popular, right? Yeah, <laughs> she did. Yeah. Because a lot of people don't like the fact that glosses are sticky. So when their hair is in their face, glosses, hair usually sticks to gloss that's super sticky. This is a very smooth formula, so you don't get that stickiness. So people like how smooth and how it doesn't feel really tacky on the lips. Mm -hmm. You can visit, yes, come, vi yes, oh, okay. Yes, I want to come to Jamaica too. Um, <laughs> send me an invite. I would love to be at a beach right now. Unfortunately, I'm, you know, I have, we have Houston, we have a beach, but it's not Jamaica, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. And what is your background, um, Angela? Oh, so uh, background in, in what sense? In like a cosmetic oh, background well, or no, no, ethnic no. background? Ethnic. Mm -hmm. Ethnic. Okay, so I'm a little bit of a mix. So my mom is from East Africa, so she's Eritrean. And my dad is West Indian, he's from the Virgin Islands. So I was actually born in Saudi Arabia and then we came to the States when I was about six or seven. So I'm a little bit of a mix of an Islander and a little bit of an East African. It's a very interesting mix. There's not very many of us that have this specific mix, but it is, it is, it is what a makes Angela. Me. Oh, beautiful mix, Angela. Thank you for sharing with us. Thank of course, of course. I was trained by just about every brand. I can't help it. The, that's amazing. 
Thank you. Gotta go. Bye, Ika. Thank you so much for being here. Thank I know you. it's getting late in New York. <laughs> I know. We're yes, and we're and and we're we're finishing up. We're all, we've done the lips. We've done it all at this point. I yeah. think, what have we have we have we missed a step? We've been talking so much. I didn't want to no. miss a step. Do we you look set beautiful? Our makeup? Exactly. I said Thank it. Yes. You, <laughs> you look it gorgeous. Can you, can know, you I, see? My friends, the difference between the shades, you know, my skin tone and Angela's skin tone, it's just, I mean, it looks glorious. I mean, look at, yeah. I cannot get over how the eyeshadow looks on you. I, I know, and that it looks amazing on you. And I just yeah, that's love cream. the fact that we're, we're two women of color. We're two different shades, but these colors look so good on both of us. And we both have two different looks. Mine's a little bit more drama, more glitz. And then yours is a softer, more subdued look, but it's still very mm -hmm. holiday, very beautiful. Yeah. I love so it. So your, your nighttime look, oh, sorry, here, your nighttime look. <laughs> your nighttime and look. you're more, yes, so we've got the two looks here going. Yes. So now we're going to finish off with a little rose water, right? You can't have Chantal yes. without any rose yes. water, right? Let's see. So I'm going to give okay. myself a little bit of a mess. It smells so good. It's I know. not a very, if you're asking, like, if this is, like, very a strong rose scent, no. This is very delicate. A very it is. delicate very, scent. Very, very, very. And then it, uh, it's also the smell of roses is also known to open up the heart chakra. So for those that believe in that, the smell of roses makes you feel loved. It opens up the heart chakra. It's always good to have that. But it also is great. And, and to, a little tip about rose water. My daughter, um, who's eight, uh, loves dairy and shouldn't have dairy. And it creates eczema. So I use it on a cotton pad. And I use it to put on her on her face where she gets a little eczema frit flare-ups, even when she was a baby. And it always kept it nice and calm. So it's good to use as a toner if you want to use it as a toner if you're a sensitive skin. Oh, as a toner too. But you just mm -hmm. said something about the chakra. And if my husband is listening, he's going to start spraying it all over him. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to feel loved. You're gonna go spray your husband with the rose water because he wants to feel loved. Rose love. water. His heart chakra. Yes. <laughs> no. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. Okay, let's see. Oh, okay, and by the guys. way, for the giveaway, I just want to mention that because the entire discount, the promo code, you know, for the gift with purchase runs all the way through Sunday. Then on Monday, I will be announcing right here on my YouTube and on my Instagram, the winner. So the way to enter the giveaway is very simple. You have to give a like to this video, be subscribed to the channel, follow Shantekai on Instagram and follow me on Instagram and comment on the post that I will be doing tomorrow. I will be doing a post of these beautiful eyeshadows open, okay? And that will let me know that you want to enter this giveaway. And yeah, that's all that you need to do. As easy as that. And you'll get to pick which one of these colors. Sorry, I'm going in the wrong way. Which one of these colors you want. You'll get a full size gold mask, which is amazing because it's a 275 value. And then everything that was in here. So you'll get that. So hang on to Jacqueline. Go follow me on H Town Mommy Makeup Artist to keep up with what's new and hot and fresh for Shantakai and subscribe to the Shantakai emailing list so that you can get any sort of promotions when they happen. We only usually have promotions twice a year. So jump on it, you guys. Yeah. And not only that, Shantakai also has a YouTube channel. And I have seen many, I mean, I have seen many of your tutorials angela yeah yeah yes, we do yeah, tips we do, and tricks we do little mm -hmm. tutorials yes tips and yeah. tricks always and we are always available for live chat if you want to go on live chat and book with one of our wonderful artists there's a gamut of people from men women hispanic black so we've got older younger we've got a little bit of everything for you so you can pick someone that you're most comfortable with as mm -hmm. well and something that I want to touch base before we kind of like wrap it up, I uh, I mean, I had had conversations with Angela and one of my questions was if Shantekai was going to ever come to say Sephora. And I really like her answer because I think this is very special. 
Can you tell wow. us? Mm -hmm. So I think that I, I was actually talking about this with Alex Shantakine. I was, we were both like, that's never been an opportunity. So that might be possibly something that happens for us in the future. You, you never know. It hasn't been an opportunity that's been presented thus far. So maybe we should be asking Sephora why Shantakai is not in Sephora. How about maybe maybe that should be the question. Though. Just kidding. Yes, but there maybe you go. we'll never never know what what happens in the future. It just hasn't been a business opportunity for us yet. But um, you never know. Mm -hmm. Yes. And this is so fun. I think everybody had a great time. I hope you guys get your hands on. I mean, the luminescent eyeshadows. Oh, you know what? Wait a second. Highlighter. Highlighter before we leave. Oh, we didn't. Yeah, we didn't do highlighter. I hope you're. I use. I have a little red blinking thing in your corner. I hope that that doesn't mean you're about to. Uh, you're about to. There's a blinking thing on your corner. Does that oh, mean my you're, camera. you're dying? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's do sure. these really quick let's before quick. we wrap up. Yeah. I'm sure. Okay. So Angela is giving me a little trick. Um, trick right here to use the luminescent eyeshadow in cheetah yeah right that's gonna be your highlighter and i'm gonna do the luminescent eye shade and lion okay so i'm gonna put this on i'm actually gonna use this i'm actually gonna just tap it in right here because i want this highlight on this corner here i need this in my life just a little that. bit you see how that just highlights look at how beautiful that looks on your cheeks oh my gosh i see that from here that's amazing. Full glam. Okay. Look at this. Yes, full glam for us to go to bed as moms. <laughs> as moms, I know. As moms. For both moms. moms. Going to bed on a Tuesday night. But it was yeah. just exciting to get glammed up because I haven't been able to wear makeup in a long time on this level. How beautiful is that? That cheetah looks amazing on you, by the way. Beautiful, beautiful. That's I awesome. love how the lion looks beautiful on you. Thank you so much, Angela, again, for your time. You're Thank welcome. you so much to Shantikai and the team for everything. I mean, I'm super excited about all these products. They are just so beautiful. Friends, do not miss out. Remember, Sunday, it ends up. <sighs> yes, yes, yes. So, yes, lion yes. on me, cheetah on cheetah. Jacqueline, Siddiqui. Mm -hmm. Manira, I'm saying your name wrong. I'm going to say Siddiqui because I know how to say Siddiqui. It's Lion and Cheetah. Lion and Cheetah. Yep. Awesome, you guys. Thank you guys for tuning in. We hope Thank to do you. it again with you guys soon. Thank you so much Let for all the support. If you have any questions, reach out. Okay, Thank let's you. stay in communication. Thanks. Thanks to you so much again. Do not forget to like the video, subscribe, go follow, please, Angela. And, you know, we stay in communication. I for sure will be doing another look with these eyeshadows and with a lot of more Shantikai products. Thank you so much to all of you. Love you. Congrats on your first live, Jacqueline. Thank you. did a you. great job. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Thanks Thank you so much. Let's to kiki together. Bye, everyone. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.